Like when I like when I first went in the classroom, uh, everyone was nice to me. They, they they didn't make me feel like I was different because everyone uh, everyone had their own little disability, and uh, that made them they're special in their own little way. The program. Uh trains individuals to, to use transit through um, eight classes uh, of, of in-class instruction and then following that they're connected with a trainer from the agency uh, which supports them um, and they are able to uh, have up to 40 hours of individual on the bus training. Since we have started this program um, Richard has been become um, more independent I would say, would you not say, honey? Yeah. Yeah. He likes to go places and do different things. He likes to learn all kinds of different things. And um, he um, really was very excited the first time he took the bus all the way on his own. We were very, very proud of him. Um, the CAP program um, is going to be giving him, giving him 40 hours of independent training, which is the best thing. And he's going to be learning routes that are important to him. Like uh, before, I like I was just sitting at home, not doing much. And now I can get on the bus, go to bowling, or I can go to uh, the movie theater, uh, see a movie with my cousin or my brother. You know, to to have a program where you can see the results. You start with somebody who maybe has never been on the bus by themselves before, maybe never been on the bus period, mm -hmm. and you can tr you can train them, and they. They just soak up this information because they're so eager to be independent. They're so eager to say, I'm an adult, I can travel on my own, I can do things on my own, I'm an independent. Like now that, uh, now that I've now learned all this stuff about the bus training and stuff like that, I can teach my brother about the bus too. I can teach him to go to the bowling and movies, stuff like that. And maybe me and him can hang out a lot more and uh, do a lot more stuff together. He's, he's learning to express himself and be part of society. And that's what's important to us and important to him. And without this, like I said, he would be at the end of his bed, um, sitting there until we got help. And it's, it's a long fight to get help. And this program is wonderful. The Community Access to Transportation program absolutely um, helps people have a sense of their own dignity. Um, not only because uh, they're getting somewhere, they're learning to get somewhere on their own, but also because part of training people and teaching people how to ride the bus safely and independently is teaching them how to advocate for themselves, ask for help when they need it, which is also an important part of being independent, and, and also teaching people to carry themselves with dignity. This program, it's taught him to open up more, and um, he's no different than anybody else now. He doesn't have to sit on the end of that bed. He can go out and be in society and be to what he thinks is a human being. Kind of, kind of uh, like a like a flower that was like a little, little buds, and now I'm blooming.